It's about 2.35 a.m. Eastern Time on Saturday, May 4th, and you're looking at a live view of Space Launch Complex 40, where the SpaceX Falcon 9 rocket is about to launch our Dragon spacecraft to the International Space Station. Liftoff is targeted for 2.48 a.m. Eastern Time, or 6.48 a.m. Coordinated Universal Time. T-minus 15 seconds. Falcon 9 is going to be flight. 10. Nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Zero. Ignition. Lift off. We will take the lift. Air Dragon goes off. Now there you can see on your left screen is the first stage and on your right screen is the second stage. We've just had a successful Miko in stage separation as well as second stage startup, which you can see on your right screen. That's the second stage engine glowing red there. We've also begun the boost back burn for the first stage. That you can see brightly on your screen, on your left screen there. And there on your right screen, you can actually see the nose cone from Dragon deploying um, and falling back down to Earth. Now that nose cone helps protect the Dragon during ascent from aerodynamic loads, but once we're in the vacuum of space, we no longer actually need it. And there you can see on your left screen there, that first stage re-entry burn has just begun. It's glowing pretty stage bright there. Two continues to follow a nominal so we're not getting a lot of sunlight, at least the engines are giving us a good view of that first stage. Now we actually don't need all nine engines for this entry burn, so we are actually only using three engines. And that completes the first stage entry burn. Stage one FTS is safe. Now the first stage landing burn should be beginning in about 20 seconds here. It's a bit dark, so we might not be able to get a great view of the first stage landing, but we'll see what we can see there. 
And it looks like we got an infrared shot of stage one there. That's an awesome view. So we're not getting a lot of sunlight. At least we could see it with the infrared view. And there's that landing burn beginning. That looks awesome. <laughs> Again, we are landing on our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. It's like we're following the first stage all the way stage to the two drone is ship. Terminal guidance. Looks like we've got a good live view of this landing here. And we have touchdown of the first stage. Falcon 9 vehicle on our drone ship. Of course, I still love you. That was an incredible view of that entire landing. That was awesome. So now going back to our primary mission, our second stage is about to meet Actually, it looks like we just had Seco, the second engine cutoff, which means we're coming Nominal up on Dragon separation soon here, waiting for confirmation of good orbit. And we have confirmation of good orbit. And we've got this live view of the Dragon trunk from the second stage uh, the aft end of the, or the forward end of the second stage. And we're looking directly into the trunk of the dragon. So inside of the trunk of the dragon, what you can see there is some of these science experiments that dragon is taking up to the International Space Station. And there you can see on your screen, dragon has deployed. And again, that is such a cool view of the science this experiments in the CCO trunk of that dragon. Dragon separation has been confirmed. As mentioned previously, Dragon is carrying tons of cargo to the International Space Station on this mission. This is Dragon CC on Countdown 1. Dragon's propulsion system has successfully primed, and all thrusters report ready for firing. There is the start of the solar array deployment. Again, this will take about a minute to complete. And we are looking at the back side of the panels, which is why you see some of that harnessing there, but the solar cells are actually on the other side of the panel. Those solar arrays are looking great. Should be locking out here shortly. And we've got full solar array deployment. Dragon is now officially on its way to the space station.